All right, guys, the trailer for Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness is out. There's a lot to talk about in it. I'm pretty sure there will be tons to come from this, especially in the next month or so where the marketing really starts to ramp up. But let's talk about a few of the things that I noticed that I want to talk about in that latest trailer. So first up, just the most obvious is the new kind of logo with more things happening behind it. I took this freeze frame here just to kind of show it off. I really do enjoy it. It's like everything spiraling out of control through the multiverse. Just thought I'd mention it. So to kick it right off, we get into Doctor Strange's nightmares that he keeps talking about having. Now, whether this is a foreshadow of Nightmare, the character, a spin on Nightmare that's multiversal, or some sort of combination of both will be very interesting. Now, the way this is cut, I do not believe that what we're seeing here is the nightmares he's having because right here, you know, that's America Chavez. And if we look at the next frame, we see whatever they are fighting here. Again, a lot of debate in regards to what this could be. Is it nightmare? Is it something completely new? Is it fake CG that they're putting in here as like a placeholder? Whatever, though, that's quite clearly them fighting in that giant place um, where... I don't know, everything looks to come together, almost like a nexus, if you will. And again, that's America Chavez, so not the nightmare here. Another thing I want to point out is the lack of highlighting and showing off Avengers Tower or what would be there. Just interesting that they're still avoiding that for various reasons, quite obviously, but I figured I mention it nonetheless. Going a little bit more mythical here with, um, we got like this Minotaur looking character with a bunch of, uh, people obviously training in some sort of academy. We could assume what academy it is where, but again, we don't know what multiverse, what exactly is going on here. And that's pretty much like the whole thing that the trailer is pushing is we have no idea what's going on and where anything is, which brings me to the next shot. So yeah, um, Dr. Strange finds himself handcuffed, being escorted by Ultron drones. Again, these are Ultron drones bringing him to Professor X, which we've seen from leaked concept art and previs. So all that is 100% real. Also, I do want to point out Strange doesn't seem to recognize any of this or anybody. So he's definitely out of his element here. This is when they're going to bring him to like judge him or something like that, I assume. Some very crazy effects here going on with everything kind of uh, bending, shape-shifting, fracturing, uh, molding, whatever you will. I'm not sure what's going on. The only thing I can think of is maybe he's tapping into different Stranges from different multiverses to try to pull in everything. Take a stab at who this is. I'm guessing this is Tom Cruise, the superior Iron Man. That's just my guess. I have no idea. But again, he's in this. The, the leaks. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Some people are saying it's Captain Marvel, which I could see how it could be her. But what would she be doing in this film in the multiverse? Unless he goes and recruits another Carol, which would honestly be very cool. Don't get me wrong. Fighting Gargantos, a.k.a. Shumagorath. Uh, Shumagorath's name is tied up with Conan the Barbarian, which is stuck on Netflix. So here's Gargantos, but it's Shumagorath. And while we're here, why don't we just go balls to the wall insane and give you this scene right here to top it all off. Uh, Dark Doctor Strange, Sorcerer Supreme, a new version. We don't really know. I guess we're going to have to wait to see the film. But good God, there is a lot going on in this trailer. This is the hype trailer. All eyes are going to be on this film now, and there's so much happening. Um, obviously, there's so much, but I saved this frame specifically for last. Let's just talk about it. So this right here is officially our first look at what is probably going to be either the proto or the setup of the Illuminati. Um, this is the people that are coming together to keep the multiverse and everything, you know, um, going. They operate as a shadowy organization. They're from different universes and they have a plan. Whoever is a member of this team keeps a secret. They don't even tell their other team members. Like Doctor Strange wouldn't go back and be like, hey, guess what, Avengers? There's this team called the Illuminati. No, it's top secret. You don't talk. It's like Fight Club in the MCU. This is obviously going to be either the proto or the setup for the Illuminati. This is where Professor X is in. This is where Superior Iron Man will be. This is where you're going to be getting all those other cameos that have been rumored. And, um, you know, if we look at all those leaks and what's been said, I think many people are now expecting legit Wolverine is probably going to be one of these. Um, 
I don't know if I believe that one myself because we already got Professor X, but maybe a version of Wolverine would be interesting. Uh, there's so many other possibilities. Doctor Doom's been rumored, which could make sense. Namor could make sense as well from the multiverse. So much you could do here. So many opportunities, but this is it, guys. This is the setup, and um, we're going to get here soon. Now, if you guys see the walking figure, it looks like he has a sword in his back. I said before, I believe that Mordo is going to end up being one of the people working in the Illuminati. I still believe it, and I think this could be the setup that he's known. Or at least one of the Mordos we're going to see in this film has known about it, or is a core member of it. So there we go, guys. My quick breakdown of it. Um, we will be back soon talking about everything else and so much more in relation to this film. So stay tuned. Subscribe, like, share, whatever else there is to do. Go listen to the podcast that will pop up up there. Every week, dropping on Saturday. A lot of people enjoy it. Hopefully, we see you there.